Our journey begins in the heart of Rome, in the 1st century AD, with the construction of the Colosseum. This incredible project was initiated by Emperor Vespasian of the Flavian dynasty as a gift to the Roman people. Over the course of a decade, a vast workforce of slaves, architects and engineers labored to bring this grand vision to life. Rising from the ashes of Nero's extravagant golden house, the Colosseum was designed to be an enduring symbol of Roman grandeur and magnificence. The purpose behind the Colosseum was as grand as its construction. It was conceived as a venue for public spectacles, gladiatorial contests, and mock sea battles. It was a place where the Roman people could revel in the might and glory of their empire, all under the watchful gaze of their emperor. Thus, within the span of a decade, the Colosseum rose from the ground, ready to host a myriad of spectacles. As we gaze upon the Colosseum, its architectural brilliance is undeniable. This monumental structure, a blend of grandeur and functionality, showcases the unparalleled engineering prowess of the Romans. It's a marvel of ancient architecture, constructed primarily using concrete and stone. The extensive use of arches, a Roman innovation, not only gives it a distinctive aesthetic appeal, but also contributes to its structural integrity. Now, let's delve a little deeper into its design. The Colosseum features a variety of column styles. The ground floor columns are Doric, the simplest and sturdiest of the classical orders. The middle floor features Ionic columns, slightly more intricate. Lastly, the top floor is adorned with the most elaborate Corinthian columns. Beneath the arena, a complex maze of tunnels and chambers unfolds. This underground network, known as the Hypogeum, was a bustling backstage area where gladiators and animals were kept before the games. Indeed, the Colosseum stands as a testament to the architectural genius of ancient Rome. Within these ancient walls, the infamous gladiatorial games were born. These games were no ordinary events, they were grand spectacles that showcased the bravery, skill, and endurance of the fighters. Gladiators, often slaves or prisoners of war, were trained to become adept fighters, each specializing in different weapons and combat styles. They fought not just for their lives, but also for the glory, the cheers, and the adulation of the crowd. The games weren't limited to gladiatorial battles alone. The Romans, ever the masters of spectacle, also staged elaborate mock naval battles. Yes, you heard it right. The arena was engineered to be flooded with water, transforming it into a makeshift sea where scaled-down warships could maneuver and engage in combat. The Colosseum was more than a stage. It was the beating heart of Rome, pulsating with the thrill of the spectacle. Time, however, has not been kind to the Colosseum. As the centuries rolled on, this grand amphitheatre faced a series of challenges, from natural disasters like earthquakes to fires and vandalism, each calamity chipped away at its majestic form, leaving it in a state of dilapidation. But let's not forget, the Colosseum is more than just a structure. It's a symbol of human ambition, architectural prowess, and the rich tapestry of history that unfolded within its walls. In recent years, concerted efforts have been made to restore and preserve this monumental testament to Rome's ancient glory. Archaeologists, historians and architects have teamed up, working diligently to breathe life back into the Colosseum. These restoration projects aim to keep the essence of the Colosseum alive, ensuring that it continues to inspire awe and curiosity in the generations to come. Today the Colosseum stands as a symbol of both the grandeur of the Roman Empire and the relentless passage of time. Today, the Colosseum is one of Rome's most iconic landmarks attracting millions of visitors each year. This ancient amphitheatre, once home to ferocious battles and grand spectacles, now stands as a silent, somber testament to the power and grandeur of the Roman Empire. As you step into this colossal structure, you can almost hear the echoes of the past. The roar of the crowd, the clash of swords, the chime of victory. As you ascend to the upper levels, the view is simply breathtaking. The sprawling city of Rome unfolds before your eyes, a stunning blend of modern urban life and ancient history. It's a poignant reminder of the city's rich heritage, where the old and the new coexist in harmony. 
and standing in the same arena where ancient Romans once stood, you feel a deep connection to history, a sense of awe and wonder. It's here, in this timeless monument, that the past comes alive and history whispers its stories. So there you have it, our journey through the Roman Colosseum, a place where history comes alive, reminding us of a time when gladiators and emperors walked the earth.